This water pump was not a big deal. It was a no-brainer. You just have to have the, the push to get it done correctly. The number one issue with the Flathead Ford is, is it going to overheat? We all know from the get-go, <laughs> is it going to overheat? Probably so, probably so. There's so many things that are involved with overheating, but I think the 50% is the water pump. You got to get that water through that radiator. I heard so many rumors that, as a kid in the early 60s, put a washer in the, in the water pumps, slow up the water, cut every other fin off the water pump impeller. Many stories like this. I never believed it when I was a kid, and I don't believe it now. So my theory was move the water quicker through the radiator. Geez, a radiator is, what, five inches with five cores? That should do the trick. Number one was the casting of the body. What we did, we machined or butterflied the casting in half so we could look at the, the hollow chamber inside. So we got rid of any sharp, sharp pathways, you know, it would stop the flow. So anything smooth would be best. So we got rid of those eddies and we just made it nice straight, you know, pathway so the water could flow easier. And we opened up certain areas of that as well. Next, we made the shaft bigger. We went from a Ford original shaft, a half inch to five eighths of an inch. That gave the pump more stability. We used a, a modern day bearing, two row of ball bearings. That really stabilized the pump, gave it a longer life. Next, we used the ceramic seal versus the old Ford seal that really never worked after a few thousand miles. Pumps are famous for leaking. My pumps won't leak after thousands of thousands of miles. Last but not least was the impeller itself. This had to be totally changed. What we did, we, we, we uh, put it up in CAD, we designed our propeller, we added more fins, longer fins, higher fins, and we actually curved them like an airplane prop. That really did the trick. That moved the water through that radiator 100%. We attached these uh, pumps before we sold them to our engine, my 40 Ford Coupe. We attached the pump to this car and it did bring the water temperature down and there was no problems. Now we only, uh, we not only make the 37, the 48 pump, that was our first one, the next one was the 48 to 52 pickup pump, which is very similar. Then the third one we just came out with is the 32 to 36 pump. 